Authorities found the dogs living in just filthy conditions in South Georgia last week. Because so many dogs were rescued, other groups are also helping care for the animals. I saw pictures of them when you guys brought them in, and the white dogs looked like they were black dogs. Apollo, when we got him, he was underweight. It, all of his ribs were showing. The first house he ever walked into was this one. So he wasn't quite sure what was going on with the inside and the air conditioning or the outside and the heat and the rain and everything. He was a little, now you can see he's, uh, he's fine. Poor little Esperanza. She wound up being the last one at the shelter. He went and picked her up and the folks at the shelter and the vet believe that she is his mom. The minute we brought her in, it was like they knew each other and they missed each other and it was like this big click. He was a little depressed on his own and now they're inseparable. Just by talking to him, petting him, playing with him, they've pretty much come out of their shells. <laughs> Look at her. I'm amazed with what she's doing today. These dogs are what it's all about. They got the veterinary cost, they got spayed. They got cleaned up. Oh my goodness, did they ever get cleaned up. They got brought here from Georgia. Folks at Pet Alliance are not just doing that. They're doing a million other things. It's beyond words and the care, the love. If it wasn't for them, I wouldn't have these two that I love every day and get snuggles with. And I appreciate them so much. So if there's anything anyone can do to help support them more than I can do to help support Pet Alliance, I would really appreciate it. Hurricane Irma is right over us right now. The first pictures now coming in from Puerto Rico after taking a direct hit. Maria is the first Category 4 to hit there in nearly a century. Category 5 hurricane force winds gusting above 225 miles per hour. Vast destruction left in the wake of Hurricane Dory and the Prime Minister calling it generational devastation. And you can see it everywhere. Some of the smallest survivors of Hurricane Dorian being flown right here to South Florida, hoping to find forever family. Adventure living up to her new name. This island dog surviving Dorian's wrath in the Bahamas. Many now hoping to land a forever home here in Central Florida, thanks to Pet Alliance. had the pleasure of going on both of their transport trips personally and picking them up. Hops was actually the very first dog I took off of a plane, so it was pretty cool. We stuck to the island side of it because of the hurricanes and stuff and the storms that were coming through, and we were really interested in her in a sense and clung to her, and that was it. We adopted him from the Pet Alliance in Sanford. He's from St. Croix. When we found out that he was from the island, it, was, it just made it even better. We fell in love with Amber immediately. She was just so chill and wanted to snuggle, and we fell in love. We're going to try and train her to be a service dog. I want to train Nala to help me with my mom and also with my uh, diabetes. We've actually gotten four animals from here throughout the last 15 to 20 years of my life, and we like this establishment. We like this, you know, how the way they handle everything, and they, they assist with anybody or any help that you need after the adoption and before the adoption. I actually live in Haines City, and we traveled 40 miles to get another dog from, from here. Last year, over 6,000 animals were adopted that wouldn't have a life. Amber, if she hadn't come from St. Thomas, would have been a street dog that probably had a very short lifespan. Pet Alliance couldn't do what they do without donations. They don't get any federal funding. Everything's run on donations. You don't stop and think all the time. You know, you take for granted what you have here. It makes you feel great inside, warm and fuzzy. I'm really proud of our organization. I'm proud of the work we do. We have a really great team here, and I wouldn't want to be any other place. I stand by you. Won't let my 